We are going to go through how to fill out your SFI Curious Minds Award application. At this stage, you will have registered for the awards, received your confirmation email, and click the link in this email to log into Sesame. When you have logged in, you'll see this home page and you can create your application for this year by clicking on the option to create either a silver award application, which was previously called the Certificate of STEM, or a gold award application, previously the plaque of STEM. If you are eligible to apply for a platinum award, you will see an additional platinum application form beside the gold application here. For this tutorial, we will be creating a gold award application. To begin your application, you will input and review your school details. All of the boxes here must be filled in order to continue on with your application. Please note that if the number of students or classes participating is larger than the total, you will not be able to continue. If you are applying for the gold award, the number of classes who have participated must be at least half of the total number of classes in the school. For a silver award, a minimum of two classes must participate. Please double check that the school name as listed on this form is correct, as this is what will be printed on your award if your application is successful. So in our example, this is Galway School. If the name is incorrect, you can edit this by ticking no, following the question labeled, is your school name correct above? And type the correct name into the update your school name box below. Once your school details are correct, Click the blue continue button at the bottom of the screen. Please ensure you have entered the correct email address for your principal. This is important as your principal will receive an email with an approval link when you wish to submit your application. You will now see the form in full and you can click on the tab for any of the other steps to go to that section of the form. This year, your log of evidence must be presented in the SFI log of evidence template. Slides can be edited in Microsoft PowerPoint or Google Slides and must be uploaded to Sesame in PDF or PowerPoint format. Images or videos added to the PowerPoint should be labeled clearly. Additional slides can be added to the template, but please note that one image per criteria will suffice as evidence. The Log of Evidence template can be found on the Curious Minds website, and it's also available on Sesame under the Upload Evidence tab. And you can find it here if you click the Download the Log of Evidence template. And here again and the templates are available both in English and Irish. As well as completing the Log of Evidence template, applicants are required to fill out the details of their activity for each section on the Sesame application form. We will begin to fill out step one, science. For each section or curriculum strand below, you will need to select what type of activity you carried out from the drop-down menu or input details of the activity into the text box. For example, for living things, we will write that second class learned about the movement of water through plants. You will see below each box that these boxes have a word count of 50. If you exceed this, the word count will appear in red text and you will not be able to submit your application. For the science activities, if, for instance, one of your classes took part in Science Week, you can select that from the drop down menu here. And for instance, if another class visited a Discovery Centre, then you can select that from the drop down. If your science activity isn't on the list, you can select Other and give details in the open text box that appears. Then you will complete steps two to five in the same way by either selecting your activity from the drop down menus or selecting other and typing the description directly. 
Once you have filled in the details for each of the required activities, next you will need to upload your evidence. If using videos as evidence, the file should be uploaded as a PowerPoint file. A PDF file will not support videos. Here's an example of a log of evidence template. I'll scroll through the steps to give you an idea of the type of evidence that is accepted. You can add slides to the template, but please remember that one piece of evidence per criteria is sufficient. Once you complete the application form, you can upload your evidence under the Upload Evidence tab towards the top right of the screen. You click the blue Upload button, and then you can drag your PowerPoint file or your PDF file here. When it's uploaded, you'll see this at 100%. Give it a minute and then you should see your file here. The maximum file size that can be uploaded is two gigabytes. And when you close this box, you should be able to see your uploaded file at the bottom of the page. Remember the log of evidence can be downloaded from curiousminds.ie or you can contact us at curiousminds at sfi.ie to request the template. If at any point during your application, you need to take a break and come back to it later, you can click the Save Draft button at the bottom of the screen. When you log back into Sesame at a later time, you can continue your application where you left off. Once you have filled out the details of your activities for all five steps and uploaded your evidence, you can click into the Confirmation tab. Here you must tick both boxes and you are ready to submit your application to your principal for approval. When you click Submit to Principal, your principal will be notified via email. Clicking on the link contained in this email will allow your principal to review your school's application. After reviewing, your principal can either approve the application or provide feedback. It is really important to follow up with your principal to ensure that they have approved the application as the application can't be submitted to SFI without principal approval. A pop-up box will appear just to confirm that you wish to submit your application to your principal and you will click yes. At this stage, please check your principal's address to ensure it is correct. If your principal doesn't receive their principal approval email and it is not appearing in either their inbox or spam or junk folders, please contact us at curiousminds at sfi.ie for assistance. Once your application is approved by your principal, you can then log in and submit your application to SFI and your application then is complete. If you are completing a silver award application, you will fill out your form in the exact same way. If you are completing the platinum award application, you will fill out each step alongside the pre-platinum section and the full platinum form. Please refer to the platinum award toolkit for more guidance on the platinum application. The pre-platinum form can be seen here. You can input your outcomes and your reasons for your chosen outcomes here. When you're ready to submit this, you can click the pre-platinum button at the bottom of the screen. You will also be able to see the full platinum form, which you will fill out following the completion of the five steps. Again, you can input details into the text boxes here. For the reflection section, there are three options. If you choose links to video, a field will appear in which you can enter URLs. And if you click upload video files or slideshow slash presentation, you can click the blue button to upload files. If you need any guidance on filling out this form, please contact your designated Platinum Award facilitator. 
and if you have any general queries on the awards or the forms, you can contact the SFI Curious Minds team by